Hey guys, what is up? It is your girl here, Misty Diaz, and I am so grateful to be putting out content right now. Um, I make sure you click subscribe, make sure you follow. If you have any questions, make sure you just shoot me a message and I'll get back to you. Okay, so today what we're gonna talk about is crutches. I've been on crutches since I was about five, six years old, and it if you know crutches, it takes a wear and tear on your hands, your fingers, your upper body, and what I have been doing for the past, I wanna say maybe two years actually, um, is I found a little trick that works for me and maybe this might work for you. Um, so what I have been doing is, here's the handle. I have regular walk easy crutches. Now, I don't know, crutch designs are really crazy and I don't understand some things when companies put out crutches, uh, forearm crutches at least is the handles are pure plastic. It doesn't make sense to me. Um, there's a lot of companies that have forearm crutches and they put their product out and there's nothing comfortable about it. And if they are, their handles are at an angle, one is for left, one is for right, at a slant, but it doesn't allow you to be independent and hold a product. So what I found to work for me temporarily, and it actually, I mean, it works in, it's been working for me the past two years is I go on Amazon and I buy bike grips. So this is a little bit more fancier of a version. Um, and the reason why it's a little bit more fancier, it's latex free. I just want to make that mention because I know some of those who are adaptive have a latex allergy and that would be a huge, huge no, no. So see the little indentations looks like little honeycombs and this is very soft this is shock absorbing and it has like these little grips so you don't slip and fall so again here here's the box i'll provide it in the description below so you can click the link in order and what i do is i cut i kind of just measure it out a little with my eye and i'll show you guys so i kind of start underneath before I cut it and I just see how much I'm gonna need so I do this kind of just get a little idea okay now you gotta remember too this also stretches so this is I'm gonna need probably like maybe this much okay so I'm gonna cut it we're gonna cut it about there because it does stretch so mind you, there's a whole roll. So you have so much to keep and it's an investment. Like it's, for this box was maybe about 16 bucks. So this was a little bit more expensive. They do make one that I was using, which is a flat surface. And this was about $9 for a roll. So, but I found this one and I'm gonna use this. So I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna wrap that around the handle. And what I'm gonna do to seal it with is I'm gonna use this 3M black tape. And this black tape stretches a little as well. So here's the 3M you can see. So let's just, let's do this. And I'm gonna do this on both handles. And I mean, it lasts me quite some time. It really does. So I'm gonna start underneath and then I'm just gonna pull, and I'm just gonna wrap it around. Okay, guys? So now that I added the grip, I'm gonna take the black tape, and I'm going to go underneath, and I'm just gonna start wrapping it. Now, if one layer is not enough, obviously you can add more layer. You still have a whole roll, which will pretty much, honestly, last you for a good seven, eight months. Like, this is lasting me a really long time. Um, so I'm just going to wrap it and I'm just going to take the tape and I'm going to go around and then once I'm done, I'm going to seal it with the warmth of my hand or you can take a blow dryer and you can just heat it along the handle. And literally that's it. If you wanted to put some of the grip as well, cause look at inside of the cuff, you can do that. Cause this is what happens. I don't know if you can see, 
this part right here, it just rubs. You can see this side is more than this side. So this is my stronger side that I use on my crutches. So I'm gonna take a little and I'm just gonna put some in the, in the cuff area. So let me show you right now. Okay, so I already finished this side, the inside, if you can see it a little. And then now I'm gonna do the inside of this cuff. And I am most likely going to either use the warmth of my hand or a blow dryer, to be quite honest, because there's glue on the back of these strips. Um, hold it here for a while. And that's it, guys. That is it. That is it. That's it. It's a hell of a lot comfortable than this hard ass plastic. Um, so yeah, bye guys. Make sure you subscribe, leave a comment. Bye.